What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Live Landon. I'm back at it with another video. And as you can see by the title today, I'm gonna be giving y'all a part two to the 2023 pickups. Cause I still got more for y'all. I told y'all last video, I was not gonna let y'all down, bro. I'm back at my crib as you can see. And today I'm finna give y'all the rest of my pickups. So without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Okay, so for the first category, we got pants, bro. I'm not gonna lie, I did pick up a lot of pants, so y'all are about to be in for a treat. I ain't even gonna lie. But the first pair of pants we got are these, these like kind of flared and stacked kind of. As you can see, it's distressing at the bottom. And then right here is kind of like flared. And it has like these like stitchings and stuff all the way down the jeans. Those are, that just makes it 10 times better. But yeah, these are a nice pair of jeans. I don't wear these. Oh, these are from Fashion Nova, as you can see. And then these are some black denims. So yeah, I don't, I don't really know how much I pay for these, but these these jeans they do run kind of like they're not like skin tight, but they're like kind of a little baggy. So yeah, these are these are those jeans. On to the next. Okay, so for the next pair of pants we got are these cargos. These like, I don't, I don't know what you would say, like a like a kind of bluish cargo. And they are from Paxon, as you can see. And they have pockets in the front, pockets in the front and pockets in the back. Basically like a cargo, as you can see. And on the bottom, this is where it's fire, bro. They got like these adjustable, like jaw strings to make them tight. I honestly keep them. <laughs> Dang, I can't talk. I honestly keep them loose. Cause like, I like the baggy look. I like the baggy look nowadays. That's like what everyone's going for. So yeah, that's the second pair of pants. Okay, for the next pair of pants we got are these, I don't know what brand this is. But here, y'all, if y'all know in the comments, just let them know. I don't really know if it'll focus. Yeah, I don't know. I try to get it to focus, but I got them from this place in the mall. They like re they have like resale shop. They sell like like exclusive like gear and shoes, Jordans, Yeezys, off whites, all that kind of stuff. But yeah, these are like these. I wanna, I would want to say like a workwear kind of. They're kind of flared at the bottom too. I don't really know what you would call these, but they got like these side. I would. These are like more like. Uh, Fred, what is that brand called? Um, I don't know. It's that workwear brand. I forgot what it's called. These are what these remind me of because they got like the the buttons and stuff. But honestly, the buttons are what really got me into these, bro. Like. I don't know, I just like that look, like that workwear look. But yeah, these are these like these black. But one thing about these pants though is like lint just like is like attracted to these, bro. Like there's like like if you see bro, there's like lint all over these, bro. And that's one thing I don't like. And they're easily wrinkled. But yeah, these are these pair of pants. Pretty good pair of pants. But yeah, on to the next. Okay, so the next pair of jeans I got are these pants from Boohoo Man. And they are these, I honestly still don't know what this says. I think it says homie, but yeah, on the front. And it's on both legs, as you can see. These pants are fire, but they also run small. So I wish I would've got a bigger size. Um, I got a size 28. I should've went for like a 30 or something. But yeah, these are a good pair of jeans, bro. I love these denims. This is like the main reason why I got them because it's just tough, bro. Like, it's just tough, bro. I just wish it didn't say like homie. Like, I just feel like, I don't know. I just kind of, I don't know. But yeah, as you can see, Boohoo Man on the back. Pretty good pair of jeans, man. Pretty good pair. I do like these jeans. I barely wear them because the sizing, bro. But honestly, if they fit, I would wear them a lot more. On to the next. So the next pair of jeans I got are some more Fashion Nova jeans. And these are another pair of flared, as you can see. 
at the bottom. They are distressed and they are some flare jeans. They have a lot of rips in them, as you can see. These ones, I cannot wear when it's cold, obviously, because the wind just be all, all in my pants. But yeah, these are just like simple blue jeans. As you can see, they're flared at the bottom. The main reason why I got them, because I'm recently getting into flared, that flared look. So yeah, just some simple pair, simple pair of flare jeans, you know. On to the next. Okay, so these next one are also from Fashion Nova. And these are kind of like a, a caramel, not a caramel, but like a tan, a tan look of another pair of flare jeans. Most of all of these are distressed at the bottom, as you can see. But yeah, I like, the reason why I like these so much are like these like rips and stuff they have in them, but they're not really rips. It's kind of like, just like distressed stitching. That's also fire. It goes almost all the way down the pair. If y'all can see that, it goes almost all the way down. And yeah, these are the back of them. As you can see, another good pair of jeans. I really do like these. I barely wear them though, cause I'm just scared to get them dirty. Cause you know, well, that one time when you go to that restaurant, bro, and that, that sauce lands on them, bro, it's over. Especially on these pair, bro, it's gonna be hard to get stains out. But yeah, good pair, good pair of jeans. Also, if y'all wanna go, like y'all don't have to go to all these expensive brands to get a nice pair of jeans, bro. Like y'all can hit Fashion Nova, Boohoo Man, uh, there's a lot of other like packs. There's like a lot of like affordable places to get pair, some pair of pants, bro. You ain't gotta always have the it's crazy expensive stuff, bro. But yeah, on to the next. Okay, so the next pair of pants, these are kind of big. So I had to like clip them up at the bottom, but these are some more cargos. And on these ones, if y'all can tell, they're not the same color. Like this, here, hold on. Let me see if I can show y'all. This, it's like the lighting is kind of bright, but as you can see, like it's like, it's like kind of like stacked. Like they're not all the, not every corner of the pants are the same color. They're all different colors, but they're like different kind of khaki. That's also why I like these, as y'all can see. But yeah, at the bottom, I had to like kind of clip them up because they do, they do run kind of long and big, so. But yeah, these are like some oversized cargos, as you can see. I've put a lot of stuff on these. This is another one, a pair of pants that I need to take Instagram flicks in. But yeah, just some simple cargos. And yeah, on to the next. Okay, so the next pair we got are some sweats. These ones, I know it's crazy, bro. I got these off of Sheen, bro. If y'all see my Sheen haul, please, bro, go like that. Y'all actually did Y'all did it cool. Y'all won't. Damn, bro. I cannot talk. Y'all, that video went crazy, bro. Like, y'all actually showed love. So, go go check that out if you, are, if you haven't already seen it. So, but yeah, we got these, these sweatpants. These ones, they're like, the material, they look good. But the material is not good. I'm sorry. They're just not. And they kind of ran small. So, I don't really wear these. But, as you can see, they have a cross right there cross right there but these are some fire looking like these on are like fire but they just don't fit me so but yeah on to the next okay so these are my last pair of pants that I picked up in the 2023 season these aren't pants well they are pants but they're not like jeans or anything these are just some simple sweats as you can see something simple they got zippers at the bottom you know and then Damn. And then they have the long strings and stuff. This is what the back this is what the back looks like. And yeah. Just something simple, bro. But next category we have are tops and like hoodies and stuff. Okay, so for the hoodie category, the first thing we got is this. Okay, so correct me if I'm wrong. I don't know exactly what Instagram brand. This is an Instagram brand, by the way. This isn't like an actual like this is this is them right there i don't know exactly where i got it from i don't remember but if y'all want to check him out that's his stuff right there but this this hoodie is fire only thing i recommend is if you 
it does not run true to size so get bigger than what you are so if you were a small get a medium if you were a large get an extra large if you were a small get a medium if you were a medium get a small i mean no if you were a medium get a large yeah get, just get a size up basically so but yeah this hoodie is so fire bro i'm just so mad because i can't wear it anymore bro i literally what size did i get i think i got an extra small because i thought it was gonna run big because a lot of these companies they run big so what i should have got was either a small or a medium but yeah that's just my recommendation if y'all get this hoodie but yeah this hoodie's fire the embroidery or embroidery like i don't know on some of these like you can see let me see if i can show y'all see like you can see bubbles and stuff in it i don't know if he meant to do that or whatever but i don't know I really didn't pay that much attention. You can't really tell from a distance, so. But yeah, this hoodie is fire. Really nice, really nice cut. Got words right here. And then on the top, it has like these shooting stars and stuff. But yeah, really nice pickup. I'm just mad because I should have got a, a better size, bro. But yeah, that's all me, bro. I should have should have read this the size chart, but on to the next. Okay, so the next thing we got is this hoodie from H&M. So basically, I cropped this myself and I cut right here. I cut the hoodie around here to make it like, I don't know, just make it like some crazy stuff. But I kind of think I cropped it too small, but it's still tough. I still like it. And this is the back, it has this on it. Pretty, this is actually a really good find for H&M. Cause sometimes, at least the one I go to, they really don't have that much, but I just wanted to add my little spin on it, just do some different stuff to it, but yeah. Simple H&M hoodie. So yeah, on to the next item. Okay, so for the next item, we got this, I don't even know, this is a ACDC rock band hoodie. I just liked the way the, the blonde, or like the, yeah, it just faded into the black. Bro, there's a crazy story with this hoodie, bro. As you can see, it is ripped down the middle. One of my friends was just messing around. I don't know how he ripped it, I don't even remember. It was like a while ago, but he just like yanked my stuff and it just tore. And I, re I remember I just got this hoodie too. But that, that, they just be, bro, I, I can't, you know, I can't even speak. Bro, I can't talk right now, bro. I'm tired. I'm sorry, bro. I'm I'm trying my best, bro. It's late, bro. I'm trying to get this video out for y'all. I'm like, I can't. I don't even think I'm here right now, bro. But let's get back into it. So, yeah, we got this hoodie. And then this is what the back looks like. Pretty simple. Pretty nice. Can go with, honestly, pretty much anything that's black and tan, you know. On to the next. Okay, so the next hoodie we got is this PacSun hoodie. This hoodie is a lot going on, as you can see. Another one that I cut the hoodie at the top and I also cropped it. I like to crop a lot of my hoodies because I just like how they look cropped. And yeah. And then they just got some stuff going on, vibing on the side. Then we got flowers on this side. And then whatever's going on right there. And then this is what the back looks like. They have this piece out on the hoodie as you can see if y'all can see that it says peace out on the hoodie and yeah that's the Paxlon hoodie on to the next okay so the next item we got I honestly do not remember where I got this from but we got this sweater this sweater is so tough bro the only problem is it kind of is a little small now I got this probably about a year ago actually no, I got the, what did I say a year ago? Well, it technically is a year ago now. I got this at the beginning, like 20, 23. But yeah, pretty, pretty fire sweater. I still don't know what's going on here. I still don't know what's going on, but yeah, this is the back. And yeah, you could just throw this on like some oversized jeans and some Timberlands and that's a fit. On to the next. Okay, so the next thing we got is this big jacket I got from Gap. This jacket is it's almost like a Kanye type jacket. Like it's like some stuff he would wear, but it's like a leather jacket. And this 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 jacket is heavy, bro. When I tell you this jacket is heavy, like I don't know if y'all can hear this, but I'm about to drop it. 
Like, bro, that's that's heavy, bro. Like, that's heavy. But yeah, it's a leather jacket. It's like this reminds me of, like some Kanye, some Kanye drip, some stuff he would have. But yeah, I just be I barely wear this though, cause. I only, really, you can only pull this out when it's super cold, and it's not really that cold in Texas like that all the time. So, yeah. But this is the this is the jacket. Simple, some simple stuff. But on to the next. Okay, so this item I thrifted. Dude, just bro, like, don't don't be on like weird stuff, but like, just see just see the vision, see the vision. So this I know it's kind of long, but like. I just felt like, since like the sleeves are long, I just feel like I could pull off something with this. So like, I got this from Goodwill. I thrifted it, but I still don't know exactly what I'm gonna put on with this yet. I'm still like trying to debate. It's just long. I might even crop this, bro. Like, just wait, bro. Like, I know y'all are looking at this like, Landon, what? You put your money towards that, but like, trust me, bro, just wait. I can actually pull something off with this. Like, just, just, just trust the process, just trust. But yeah, we're gonna go on to the last item. Okay, so the last item I got is this Nike like tracksuit thing. The only reason why I got this because it looked like 80s or it looked like vintage, like it's just like some old like tracksuit vibes. So that's why I picked it up. It just gave me some like I don't know. It just gave me like like 90s Nike, you know, that 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 superior superior years of Nike, bro. That's like my favorite years. But yeah, bro, this Nike like kind of zip up pretty fire has nike on the back as you can see nike air and yeah just something simple but yeah that's the last that is the last item hopefully you guys enjoyed it bro i told y'all i would give y'all with this part two that is everything that i purchased in 2023 hopefully you guys enjoyed bro I'm like I said, bro, I'm still like, I'm trying to really get deep into fashion right now, bro. Like, you don't even understand, bro. Like, I just be, I don't know. I just want to step out of my comfort zone, just try different things with this fashion stuff. Just know, bro, 2024 is going to be crazy fashion up. Nah, I'm saying, but now nah, I'm playing. But that is the end of the video. Hopefully, you guys liked it, bro. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more. And that is the end of the video, so. Peace. Everything gone. I had the fool when I go and perform, but I'm trying.